Hi friends, in this tutorial, I will show you how to convert the binary number into its equivalent hexadecimal number. The numbers 0 to 9 and A to F are used to represent the hexadecimal number system. So the base is 16, whereas the binary number system uses the numbers 0 and 1. So the base of the binary is 2. If we write the hexadecimal base, in terms of binary base, 16 can be written as 2 power of 4. That is, the hexadecimal base is 4th power of binary base. So, with the help of 4 bits, we can represent the hexadecimal numbers from 0 to 9 and A to F. Our aim is to convert the given binary number to its equivalent hexadecimal number. So to do this conversion, first break the given binary number to group of 4 bits and convert each group into its equivalent hexadecimal number. First we will see how to convert the binary number 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1. 1 0 1 1 First break the given binary number to group of 4 bits and do the grouping from right to left. So start from here. So first grouping is 1 0 1 1. Then next group is 1 0 0 1. Then the next group is 1 0 0 0. Then the fourth group is 1 1 0 1. So we'll write each group 1101 That is the groupings from right to left. In binary, the weight is 2 power 0, 2 power 1, 2 power 2, 2 power 3. That is 1. 2 4 8 so put weight here 1 2 4 8 then 1 4 8 1 2 4 8 1 2 4 8 multiply each digit with its corresponding weight so 1 into 1 1 plus 1 into 2, 2, 0 into 4, 0, so we can leave that, 1 into 8, 8, for this group, 1 into 1, 1, 0 into 2, 0, so we can leave that, 0 into 4, 0, we can omit that, 1 into 8, 8, so for 0, 0, for first 3 digits, uh, 0, so we can leave that, the fourth digit is 1, 1 into 8, 8, so for this group, the first digit is 1, 1 into 1, 1, second digit is 0, so we can leave it. The third digit is 1, 1 into 4, 4, fourth digit is 1, 1 into 8, 8. So we will sum this, 1 plus 2 plus 8, it's 11, 1 plus 8, 9, here 8, 1 plus 4 plus 8, which is 13. In hexadecimal number system, A equal to 10. B equal to 11, C equal to 12, D equal to 13, E equal to 14, F equal to 15. So 11 can be written as B, 9, 8, 13 is D. So the given binary number. 1101 can be written as D 8 9 B B 16 This example doesn't have any fractional portion Next we will see another example with the combination of integer and the fractional portion. 
Now we will see how to convert the binary number 10101010101.010101. The first step is we have to break the given binary number into group of four digits. So here we have the integer portion as well as the fractional portion. First write the given binary number 10101010101.010101 After the fractional point do the grouping from left to right Before the fractional point do the grouping from right to left So first we will do the grouping for the fractional portion here the first group is 0101, the second group is 01. For the integer portion, the first group is 0101, the second group is 101. We'll write the each group 101, then 0101, point 0101, 01. First group has only two digits 0 and 1, so add two more zeros to make four digits. And the last group has three digits 101, so add one more zero. Now the weight of the binary system is 1248. 1248.1248. Multiply each digits with its corresponding weight. The first two, two digits are 0, so we can leave this. The third digit is 1, 1 into 4, 4. Fourth digit is 0, so we can leave that. In the second group, the first digit is 1, so 1 into 1, 1. Second digit is 0, we can leave that. The third digit is 1, 1 into 4, 4. Point. In the third group, the first digit is 1, 1 into 1, 1 plus. 0 into 2 0 plus 1 into 4 4 the fourth digit is 0 we can leave that the fourth group the first digit is 1 1 into 1 1 the second digit is 0 so we can leave that the third digit is 1 1 into 4 4 so we will sum 4 4 plus 1 5 point 4 plus 1 5 4 plus 1 5 the binary number 10101.01.01 base 2 can be written as 55.54 base 16. Binary to hexadecimal conversion is very simple. The first thing is we have to break the given binary number into group of four digits and convert each group digit into its equivalent hexadecimal number. Hope you understand this concept. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos.